Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. In today's video, yeah, as you guys can see from the screen, we are going to be doing another player review in today's video. Today's video is going to be around Falcao, the ultimate birthday promo card. Now, I don't know how many of you guys remember Falcao, but I remember him from the good old AC Monaco days. So, I hope you guys will enjoy this video. Now, without any further ado, let's get into this video. So, if you guys see a look at the card, the Falcao card, he is a striker that's the first thing that we all are gonna see obviously an 88 rated striker from la liga and he is playing for a good team the team is actually not that bad the team is in in real life they're performing really well and off the bat if you guys look at the card he is a five star weak foot and a four star skill move card and he has a high attacking player work rate and his right foot is his preferred foot so with left foot he can bang goals in now uh, with this new promo and if you guys look at his uh, stats 90 pace guys 90 pace with 84 dribbling and under dribbling if you guys go to balance it says 94 balance with 92 ball control that two those two combinations are really good with 90 pace it's gonna be insane now we will definitely be adding some uh, chemistry style to him but before we go that far into the video let's just look at his uh, shooting and physical as well he has 92 attacking position he has 88 uh, finishing with 85 shot par shooting is a bit low for me i mean we are gonna be trying him in a game later on in this video so we'll we'll see if this if, if this 87 shooting is actually true to the stats or it's it's just another card where the stats say something but the player is actually good uh now play styles he has two play style pluses one is uh finish shot plus and the other one is power header so you can have some good heading uh you know some heading goals with him do does he have good uh, jumping and uh, he has 90 jumping with 19 heading accuracy so yeah it makes sense he has chip shot as well long ball pass and all those good stuff with physical oh he has trivella that's nice okay we need to try trivella as well i still haven't figured out how to properly get a trivella but we will try all that and yeah so this is an objective card it's not an sbc card i'm pretty sure you guys would have uh, seen the objective part of this so to get falco to, you have to complete the objective you need to get seven goals with a colombian player while playing and then you need to play 12 games you need to win yeah uh, i think eight games you have to win yeah you need to win eight games with three la liga players in the squad you need to get six assists with a player who has 85 pace minimum and then you have to play 12 games it's just normal squad of whatever you can use you can use and then you have to score seven goals with a colombian so i think this is an easy uh, set of objectives except for the 12 games it took a long while guys i actually start i finished the i finished speedy assists and the uh, colombian masterclass within three hours of the start releasing and then the the wins was easy but playing 12 games was a pain because it's just too long but now we'll go add him to the club and we'll see how he fits in the club i'm pretty sure he's gonna fit uh, pretty well so i'm gonna bring my lovely rasmus hoyland to the reserves and um, you know what yeah actually you know uh, yeah. I have a lot of players that I have not used yet, so I need to actually go and see how these guys are. Now, let's just do just a small comparison between Falco and Hoyland. If you guys look at the right side, uh, Fal uh, Hoyland has better pace and better shooting than Falco, and Falco has better passing, dribbling, and uh, he has better defense, which defense nobody cares about, realistically speaking. So, I think dribbling Falco has better than Hoyland and then physical holland physical passing and sh i mean pace and shooting pace shooting and physical holland is better but both of them are 88 rated players so that's why i wanted to do uh, i wanted to show you guys uh, what it's all about now if you guys are interested in this card the card that i'm actually on the screen right now make sure you guys are on the lookout for that we are going to be doing an evolution review just like we did um the evolution review for weak foot uh, peak we're going to be doing an evolution review for another evolution that is interesting now actually let us go 
and to play some games we are going to be playing uh, one squad battle and i'll just show you guys how the falco card is and then i'll let you guys know my verdict if this if actually sitting and grinding so much is worth it or not okay i'm gonna actually apply some uh, chemistry style on to falco i think i'm gonna apply sniper or hunter one of these two is what i'm looking for you know what let's just apply hunter okay ultimate birthday falco with the hunter chemistry style will he be any good now uh, this game is purely just to show you guys how uh, falco's dribbling is how his shooting is all that good stuff and how his pace is so i will let you guys know how falco actually i feel after playing this game and uh, during this game i'll let you guys know his stats and if it's actually to the stats on the card or is it just another card where you know like i said where ea just puts a stat but the card is actually way better the ball control feels a little bit off not gonna lie he's taking a lot of unnecessary uh, you know touches which makes the ball go a bit wide but apart from that the dribbling is not bad you know the shot was clean left foot nice weak foot he has five star so that was a good shot with the weak foot and he had good dribbling as well the ball control is a bit weird it feels really weird with the ball control guys i'm not gonna like oh my god the shooting is actually not bad guys 87 shooting is just a card start i feel like shooting is actually good on him and since we put hunter as well that boosts his shooting a lot and i am actually not i'm not too uh what do you say tired of the card you know and now the trivella is one thing i have to try uh we'll try it out soon ah trivella is not bad i mean I did shoot from inside the box, so I don't know how true it is gonna be. Uh, he his weak foot is left, so he's gonna be taking travelers with his right. I'm guessing. So I have to come from. Okay, yeah, we'll try, we'll try. Okay, you know what? The card for uh, Falco is not bad. The shooting is really good. His pace is really good. His dribbling is not so. Uh, shabby because sometimes the ball control feels a bit off and feels a bit weird the shooting when it comes to trivella it is it still is weird uh, you guys saw how he just had to reposition in front and then once the shot was really good but it was not on target it went uh, over the bar and once when i shot from the other side opposite side he still took it with the right foot if he would have taken it to the left foot then maybe he would have got a goal because that was a really good shot and it was almost on target but yeah i think the card overall is is a decent card we haven't tested his heading accuracy but that's because it's just not getting that opportunity but i'm pretty sure it will be decent it will not be something great and out of the world he does have playstyle plus for a power header so yeah i think it will be decent you know so i think you guys should do this i mean it is going to take a long time to complete this card but i think it is it is still worth it mainly because it is a fodder 88 rated card at uh, this time in efc is always fodder so make sure you guys complete the card the card is actually not bad you can actually use him but if you guys have already got uh, rasmus hoyland i think you guys are better off with hoyland because uh, he is really good even compared to some of the 90 90 91 rated uh, strikers out there i think rashmi finland is actually really well i have been playing with him a lot so yeah i'll see you guys in the next video make sure you guys are on the lookout for uh, another evolution review as well and there are going to be a lot of more pack opening case part 2 is going to come out soon for ultimate birthday and fifa mobile also there are a lot of videos coming your way so yeah i'll see you guys in the next one until then take care stay safe stay motivated and keep smiling bye bye